Libra, welcome back, guys. So let's go ahead and get started with your weekly reading. Let's see what is going on with you for this week. We're going to see what is this overall energy. What are your messages? What do you need to be prepared for? Guys, please keep in mind that these readings are timeless, general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does and leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you're meant to hear it, and there is no gender in tarot. Reverse the roles as need be. Cross watchers, you're always welcome. All right, guys, let's go ahead and see what are your overall messages for this week in regards to love. What is coming? What? Wow. Libra. Wife, engagement, bride. Okay. Bottom of the deck, romance, sweetness, flowers. You're about to meet somebody new. There is someone new. Now, guys, keep in mind, new energy doesn't necessarily mean it's someone completely completely new it could be somebody from your past that's coming towards you with new energy with new intentions with new motivations okay so whatever this is it is going to be new to you the dove peace and serenity someone is coming into your life whether it's someone from your past or someone completely new but this person is going to bring in so much love peace harmony and balance it is a sweet abundant connection there's flowers there's dove and there's bride it's a beautiful energy between you and someone who who's who you're gonna love or who's who's gonna fall in love with you whatever it is the point of the matter is that there is a lot of love and a lot of of happiness that's going to be presented to you libra i do feel that you've been dealing with the lamp Okay, you survived from a lot of situations here with the shark, a survival of power. You dealt with a lot with people in the recent past. People have betrayed you. They've mistreated you. They've disrespected you. I just heard they stole from you. Okay, you've been dealing with people who have been very controlling. But you always knew that at the end of the day, wisdom keeper, whale, you would, you would survive. And this is crazy because I see this whale here and then the baby whale. And it's like you protected yours. You protected what you most loved. And because you've you've managed to heal from that past and you've managed to let go of any type of anger, you're about to be blessed with a beautiful new opportunity. For some of you guys, you've been single for quite a bit. You've been a single parent possibly for quite a bit. And there's about to be a beautiful new connection that's going to be presented here. Somebody wants to make you their wife or make you their husband. Someone wants to bring in romance, sweetness. And someone wants to bring in peace and serenity into your life. It's a new, beautiful opportunity. It's a new beginning in love for you, okay? So we're not sure yet if it's somebody completely new or if it's just someone coming from the past that has renewed their intentions here. Universe, Archangels, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. What is this overall energy here for my Libra, please? What is going on with Libra? What can Libra expect this upcoming week? Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. What can my Libra expect, please? Wow, the sun. Damn, Libra. Damn, damn, damn. I don't know what else to say, but I feel like you've been through so much crap in the past. Like you're like you've you've li literally have questioned and you've asked God why? Why do I go through all of these things? Why why can't I be happy? Why can't I have a stable? All of those things because you have let go of the why can't I and you started speaking into fruition that I will and I do and I have. You're about to bring in so much happiness into your life. Something is changing for you really quickly, okay? You've dealt with a lot of challenges. You dealt with a lot of adversity, I just heard. You've managed to be a very courageous, independent individual. You've let go of people, places, and things that don't serve a purpose for you. And here it is, okay? Three of Wands, Energy, Forward, Movement, Victory, and Success. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. There's some action that's going to be taken in your behalf. I do feel like this week, the person that you're meant to be with is going to be coming towards you. There's been a transformation here. So again, Libra, for a lot of you guys, you've gotten out of that energy where you stopped saying, why can't I have? And you started saying, I do have. Okay, you've changed your perspective, you've changed the way of thinking, you've changed the way that you say things into the universe. Okay, and because you have been putting yourself in this high vibrational energy and you're putting yourself in this place where things for you have changed already, and you're 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 not necessarily in that committed relationship, but you're playing the role that you already are, it's like you're role playing. You're bringing in all this victory and success. Universe, archangels, spirit, angel guides, and guardians. What is this overall energy for Libra here? 
I have the Three of Swords, the ending of heartache, okay? Hangman clar uh, clarity as well. So I feel like you surrendered to the heartache. You surrendered um negativity you just surrendered everything that does not serve a purpose for you anymore okay you let go of those people that were a burden for you in the past you let go of situations even employers that caused you burdens okay you've decided to move away from situation people places and things it's like you have let it go and you, you know what it is it's like that whole saying give the wheel to jesus G jesus take the wheel that's what you've done jesus take the wheel and you've let go of, of the situation. You know that you can't control it anymore. You can't control people's actions or outcomes. So what do you do? You 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 stop putting in all this energy and you start focusing on yourself and your loved ones. What is this overall energy here, universe? You got the seven of pentacles and you got the page of swords energy. For some of you guys, you block someone, okay? You moved away from a situation that just was not growing anymore, a situation that you were not in a good place with mentally, emotionally, possibly even physically because believe it or not, we all know it. When we get into those committed relationships, when things are going good, things are going good. We're both gaining that weight. We're both doing certain things. You know what I mean? But when a relationship is on the rocks and things just seem very heavy, sometimes one of us declines more than the other. Nine times out of ten is generally one person because one person is carrying more of the heaviness in the situation. But the truth of the matter here is that you've decided to block somebody from your past. I do feel that someone is missing you. Um, they're anxious. They're wondering what you're doing. Yeah, there you go. Seven of Cups energy thinking about you constantly. This person that you decided to walk away from is having a very hard time right now. Okay. It's like they're, they're finally reaping what they sowed. This person put you through a lot and now it's like they're going through their trials and tribulations. But you, you have something beautiful coming in. You have something abundant coming in. Universe, Archangel, Spirit. I just heard lessons learned, okay? This is justice. This is karma at its best. It's like for such a long time, you put up with people and people's unnecessary bullshit that now that you've decided to walk away from those things and no longer give those people energy, now you're bringing in all this justice. Now you're bringing in all this victory and success. But you know what it is, Libra? Is you deserve it. You deserve this happiness. You deserve this victory. Universe, what are the final messages here for Libra? Universe, Archangels, Spirit, Angel Guides, and Guardians. What are the final messages for my Libra, please? Ego, mind, pride, vanity, appearance, matters, six of wands, bound, expectations, and or and or approval. So I feel like you're in that place where you're feeling yourself and right as you should. Okay, you've been through a lot. You 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 let yourself go at times because of another person. Now you're in this place where yeah, you know your worth. Okay, it's not about ego, but it is about knowing your worth. You look good. You smell good. You you're in a good place, and there's nothing wrong with being proud of who you are. With a Jupiter action inspired risk. There's this this opportunity here, a new beginning, new fortune for you. So like I said, someone is coming in this week and you're going to look at this person and you'll be like, is this the one? Is this the person that I'm meant to be? Something in your intuition is going to tell you, yep, we brought you this person. Somebody in your past regrets their actions, but somebody in your future is ready to take a leap of faith with you. So again, whatever has happened in the past, you've already let it go. But what's going on for you right now and in the very near future is new beginnings and new opportunities, Libra. So let go of those people. It is what it is. Don't hold on to that energy no more because you got new beginnings literally right around the corner this week. All right, guys, I hope and pray that this reading gave you the clarity that you needed. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell. And if anyone is interested in a personal reading, the information is in the description box below. I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye.